Good morning! It is officially the day that my wraps come off. I washed my hair last night. I feel so much better. My hair was disgusting. And unfortunately, I posted a TikTok. And yes, I love when TikToks like do a little bit better than my other TikToks. So I have one that's doing pretty good right now, but it was before I had taken my shower. And I talk about needing to take a shower, and I look like literal trash in that TikTok. Hold on. Let's play that TikTok right now. Five days post-op. Yes, I'm counting these fingers here too from getting breast implants. I have such a sexy update. I desperately need to wash my hair even though the wrappings come off tomorrow, which I'm starting to be able to move them more and I can like see what they look like. But I'm in desperately need of washing my hair because it's disgusting. And also, I haven't pooped since surgery, which I know is totally TMI, but I'm sharing every part of this journey. So today is suppository time. I stick this up my butt and that makes me poop. I said that works better than doing any oral stuff because it's like stuck at the bottom. TMI again, but oh, start to see the girls are starting to pop out, starting to be visible. Ignore the thing I'm sticking out my butt and just look at my boobs, okay? So obviously I look like trash in that and it probably has a lot more views than some of my other ones recently. But either way, my hair is washed now. Hold on. I have to switch arms. Like normally I vlog with my left arm, but my left implant's a little bit sore. I went off my painkillers. I think I told you guys about this in this video or the one before. I went off my painkillers and I didn't use them any at all yesterday. And I haven't used them today and I can feel my implants a little bit more, but they're not sore per se, except the left side, like the incision part is not comfortable. But either way, I need to figure out what I am going to wear today because it's cold and rainy, but I know like, I need to be able to fit the wraps underneath it and take them off and then have something to wear afterwards. So I think I'm going to go with like a cute fall outfit. I love, love, love this cardigan thing I got. I almost didn't get it because it was kind of expensive in my opinion. And maybe I will wear a hat. I wasn't planning on wearing a hat, but maybe I will wear a hat because it is, well, I'll have to put my you know, hair tied down a little bit lower. I think I will wear a hat because it is kind of like grainy and I feel like it fits the aesthetic and fits the vibe. And also my hair is hella frizzy. I go, look at that. Oh, this is a thumbnail right here. I think overall it looks cute. Looks a little weird right here, but these are my wrappings. I brought tops in my bag, just a like burgundy bag. I have top in there and like keys, nothing heavy. So it's not like I'm like, holding a lot of weight it looks like it but it's just easiest way to carry a t-shirt because i'll put on a t-shirt after they take off my wrappings and get me in that silly surgery bra but overall i think it's a cute rainy day outfit and now um let's rush to my appointment it is definitely a cloudy rainy one they said to drape this over me, not really sure if this means like this, but you know, it's a look. Either way, I am so happy to get these wrappings finally off. Yeah, they're oh. nasty. It's time, it's time to take the wrappings off. It's time to get this, the wraps off for you to see your tatas. That would be great. Yeah, windowsill works perfectly. All right, <laughs> scooch all the way back. Oh. I'm, I'm sitting down or laying down? You're sitting down. Oh, this is a look. Yes. <laughs> throw your fabulous hair off to the side. All right, let's undo this. Yeah. Try to relax. You can. Yeah, it literally only started today. I'm actually, and then arch your back. All of this. Whoa. That does look good. Yes, that's a term I love. Ooh, it, <laughs> Boy, they feel, you feel them more I, now. Exactly. But this is good. Yeah, like this side, like no when problem. you did that, no problem. This side, all in there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, everything looks good. So I'm super happy. Mm -hmm. um, you're super swollen through here. So oh, okay. as the swelling comes down, you're going to start to see more cleavage here. They're going to drop. All right. So we're gonna put on another lovely haute couture. I'm telling you, that one's just not behaving. <laughs> Actually, she is. She looks good. No, I don't believe me. <laughs> <laughs> and question: Do we go smaller? I know I've heard a lot of people feel like that, but did we? You know what? I don't know. Dr. Perez will come in and okay. let you know exactly what we put in. Have we have a look? Okay, thank you. 
a little modesty for a hot second. <laughs> All right, let me go get him. Thank you. You're welcome. Hello. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Pretty. You got your makeup on and your yeah. hat. You know, I gotta look somewhat like yeah, I'm not. You know, I love it. That's usually a good up. sign when patients come in with cute clothes. <laughs> and makeup, then that means that you're feeling great. Lovely. Lovely. Beautiful. Excellent. Well, these look amazing so already. So, okay, so your pec muscle comes down like this across the top, okay. okay? And that is what needs to loosen up. And so now you're about a week after surgery, and so all we do is monitor the incision. We're gonna clean them. We're gonna put these little pads on there. And those do two things. They're padded, so they're comfy. And they also have antibiotic in them, and so they oh. just help keep the incision clean. Okay. That's so interesting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you've got 325 Meyer Propostia intra implants. Oh. Okay. Um, it just seems smaller than the one like the sizers. And so everything looks exactly the way it should right now. So Tammy's putting these little plastic bandages over top. Those just keep everything clean and dry. Okay. So you want to be doing at least 70 grams of protein a day. Okay. From your supplement alone. Okay on top of what you're eating. So you're oh, because I living. normally eat a very like high protein diet. You do? Yeah. Cause... We still want more. Okay. Because okay? your body is trying to heal, and so it's an On top of that. Exactly. Oh, okay. Let's do this. Let's get this set up just a touch. Perfect. There you mm -hmm. go. Nice and gentle, nice and gentle. Okay, the other thing that we usually start doing around two weeks mm -hmm. is arm exercises. Okay? Gotcha. And so we'll, we'll do that all starting next week. So these are those pads. Oh, I remember, yeah. Get. I was like wondering. So these are going to act a little bit amazing in the little areas between the incision and the bra. So but it's going to okay. kind of hang out. Ooh. Yeah. Cute. So look. It's definitely a look. All right, so how's it been so far? You think easier than expected about on, on course? It was definitely easier than I expected. The only thing that was like bad was getting out of anesthesia. Yeah. Like that was hard. Well, I never want to be sedated again. That's your new look. It's a good thing you're wearing a cute hat. <laughs> <laughs> and so then I just wear, so I take off those things and you said how many days? Um, so take them off, say Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, take them off on Thursday. Thursday. Okay. Thursday, take those off, but keep with this look. Yeah. Yes, Perfect. ma'am. Thank you. All right, lovely. Nice okay. to see you. I All appreciate right. it. Bye. I am now out of the appointment. Ignore the sound of traffic, but it feels so good to be in an actual shirt and not in the wrappings. Like the stupid, like, surgery bra, you can see it, but it covers up with this and, oh, just feels so good. Mostly because I've been wearing that for like, what, five days now? I think I'm five days post-op. I've been doing updates on TikTok. But either way, I feel so good to be out of those disgusting wrappings because I've been wearing them for a while. Also, it's not like they're comfortable. They're not a shirt. I wasn't trying to pull a shirt over that. I was sometimes like buttoning things over, like swinging things over like this, but it wasn't the same. Like, oh, I feel so much more human and less like I'm in recovery now that that is off. And actually, now that that is off and I'm in that like surgery bra, which the surgery bra like those are like the padding that's not my nipple this is like the padding underneath it so it doesn't hurt your incisions point is the um surgery bra is a lot more comfortable than those wrappings like so much more comfortable now like my left left boob hurts a lot less and oh my outfit is on point he's like asking me about my jacket love my jacket either way i before i go home i know i probably should just go home but i haven't left the house in like for a week so either way, well, less than a week, okay? I'm being a little dramatic, I know. But either way, Trader Joe's is like right across the street from the surgeon. Well, not right across, like across and over. So I figured I would head over to their parking lot park there. And then obviously I'm not walking, so I'm not putting too much strain on my body. And going to Trader Joe's, maybe get some food, probably not too much. Oh, this Trader Joe's is so pretty. I'm debating if I want like an easy snack meal and just get some of the wraps. But I don't know if any of them sound tempting. I think I might pick up some of the orange chicken. I like this one. Not that I need it at all. I'm most debating about getting some of this again. But I might not. But I think I am going to get some of the bread that's over there. And this bread was good. So I've gotten three, four compliments on my outfit and it hasn't even been a long trip. So honestly, 
I think this outfit is a yes. It is a yes for sure. I already knew it because it's so cute in fall and it's a rainy day and it's just like it's perfect. So I'm happy, especially since I haven't been out for a while. So it's nice to you know, just have people talking to me and kind of complimenting me. Who doesn't like that? Um, either way, it was like my doctor had mentioned and like complimented my jacket. And then one of the girls in there, the one that like gave me a sample, was like, she's like, I love your outfit. It's perfect. Like everything, like your hair, your skin tone, everything works together. It's like you look like the front of a Pinterest board. And I'm like, well, thank you. Wait. Actually, I think this is the end of the vlog because it's gonna be a little bit until I have a bigger vlog like update on the implant series So definitely check out those other videos and I'll probably have other implant videos coming up But it's gonna be a little bit until a vlog comes if you want any more in between the scenes like Daily update stuff that doesn't really make it to vlogs like smaller things definitely check out my socials But I do post a new video every single Wednesday helping you figure out adulting while I'm attempting to figure it out myself So please 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 hit the like and subscribe button down below it means the world to me i love that this channel is growing that my audience is growing i love that you're here watching this with me i love being able to share my life with you and share advice with you and share experimenting with you and trying different things with you and i'm blabbering but i hope you have a great rest of your morning evening night whatever it is for you i'll see you wednesday